for animals, it's my here back to another video for you guys today, and today you're going to meet my new pet that I've had since the return, I think, of my videos, but I've just, there's been other things going on with losing animals, um, and speaking of that, um, in the beginning of the last video I did say that my heart rat, Hope, passed away, and heat actually took um, we had like a massive heat wave it was like 110 degrees for the last few days which is not normal for where I live and it actually took one of the rats one of the mice and hamster but I really don't want to talk about that and make things sad so yeah that happened and it's something I've been dealing with but today's video is happy we're going to introduce you to my new pet also, um, my lips are really pink, so I'm my hands from a lip stain that was not this dark, but I was super cute because it was dark. It was not this dark when I put it on, so I tried to wipe it off, and now my fingers are pink, and so I'm my lips. But it's okay. That's not my dog here. Miracle. But yeah, I'm going to introduce you to my new pets, which are frogs. I have two frogs now. Not two frogs that can be together. I have a female Pac Man frog named Margo. I'm gonna see if I can put a picture here, but if not, my editing system failed me. But yeah, maybe I can put a picture here. If not, I'm sorry, you'll see her in a second. And I also got another frog who is unsexed currently and doesn't have a name, even though sometimes I'll call him Fargo and I call him him, but I don't know what he is yet and he is a african bullfrog i think or like a pixie frog so people call them yeah so they're in their own separate 10 gallon tanks right now but um later on fargo will be in a 40 gallon and margo will be in a 20 gallon i think that's what i've read it's good for them but if I get other information or someone tells me different, then of course I will listen and do what's best for them. But yeah, I'm going to feed them so you guys will be able to see them then. I don't like messing with Fargo. He gives me a heart attack and he tries to attack me all the time. So I really don't want to mess with him. I'm having anxiety with this. So we're going to feed Margo first. So that's basically all I have to say. I've had them for about a month or two now. And they came in a bit like um, a storage bin. If I can put pictures in, I'll put a picture in here of what they came in. Um, which then a lot of people told me like that's not good for them. So I only plan on getting one frog. I only wanted a Pac Man frog, but he, um, the pixie frog came with, so I decided two frogs was fine. I'm not exactly sure if. I will keep Fargo. I mean, I th I'm pretty sure I will, but there's just a chance that I might rehome him because he kind of requires a lot of care and gets really big. And personally, I don't know if a 40 gallon is even big enough for him, depending on if he's a male or female. And a 40 gallon is like the max of what I can do. So if he gets bigger than um, that, I will rehome him to where he could have a larger tank um, and a larger enclosure space. But for now, He'll be here because he's still a little baby. He's like, mm, he's that big. And so is Margo. So yeah, I will be referring to him as Fargo in this video, but that most likely will not be his permanent name. I kind of want to name him Bob, but he's mean. So I need like a mean frog name. Leave your comments down below. Anyway, let's go see them. Also, I'd like to mention, besides this, I also have a scar on my lip up there from a scab. And I'm very sunburned, which is why my nose looks like that. And why my skin is so blotchy and different colored right now. And that's why I've also gotten very tan, as you can see. Uh, I don't know if you can see the difference in my skin color. Can you see? Not really. Yeah, I got really tan. And sunburned. This, though, isn't a sunburn. That's just blush. But I shouldn't have put that makeup on because it, it's sunburned underneath. But uh, uh, let's just go see the works. Okay, so Margo's in here. I have her laid. That'll be sitting on the floor. Her cage is pretty bare. 
because she doesn't really use anything in it anyway. This is the water that I use. It's empty, so I need to get the other one from upstairs. But yeah, she's in here somewhere. Not exactly sure where she's at. Okay, I need to find her really quick, one second. Okay, I found her. Here she is. Let me see if I remember. Hey, baby. He's here. Here you go. So I have her worms here. Worm trigger warning if you don't want to see it. So. Yeah. Let's clean it off in her water and then I dump the water onto bring the water. if she wants another one. I don't know if she will. But Misty doesn't eat these anyway, so. Ew. Ew. I think she's good. Yeah, she's moving, so that usually will mean she's done. We'll see. We'll just break the light for a second. So she wants it. Sometimes I have to do kind of like the assist feeding thing, but not really. I gotta have to like put it right now. Okay, she's done. So. 
I'll show you what I do. This is my care for her. Zoom you guys out. Her water will be washed uh, tomorrow, probably. Right now, in about two days. I don't wash her dish every day. So I'll fill up water. We'll put her stuff back in. Put this little hide. Let me see if I can grab her. I have freshly washed hands, by the way, guys. So, and I'm gonna grab her in the dirt. Oh, she wants me to. I don't think she wants me to touch her. Come here. Come here. Come here, girlfriend. You guys here? There you go. You can go back in your pool. Instantly dirty. <laughs> My hands are slimy. Okay. Also, I'd like to know, I just made out with this hand. And I also um, spread them down before even putting the camera back on over here. So, yeah. She's good. Don't worry. Don't worry about her. She's fine. So I'm not going to spray her feed jar. Put her plant back in there. Cover her hole. So she can pick a new hole and not get any kind of type of thing. And then, last thing I do, spray her lid back on. Sorry, girlfriend. Go to the top of it. And she's good to go. Now let me get boy boy. Okay, so he's like re Oh, you can actually kind of see him. Right there. Can you see that? What is What part of him is that? Can't really tell. Yes, my rats are fighting the back. Don't worry. They're just... They're... First day in there, so they're kind of deciding who's the boss. So let's go ahead and try to get him out. I did move him up here just because he didn't even down there. It's not something I have ever done because it's very difficult. I'm really scared, guys. <laughs> he really scares me. Like, really bad. <laughs> okay, let me grab, let me get him out. So there's Angry Man. Get, hey, get. Sorry, my cat jumped up there. There he is. He's not happy. Come on, get out. There you go. He's not happy. You can't really see him because. Let me see him. There he is. He's right there. Tank is very dirty. But yeah, he eats other things like super worms and worms because he doesn't like these. Okay, he doesn't. Like these, so we don't feed them to them. Well, I don't know why I said we. I don't feed them to them. I'm gonna eat them. So, I guess I have supplements will be here on Tuesday. But, yeah. I'm gonna see if he wants some worms. He should, because he hasn't eaten in like a week. Because he. They don't eat very often. He doesn't like to eat very often. Let's see. Can you see that? My kittens are intrigued by this as well. Hey! No! Get! Look, hey, buddy. Look at that. Look. Don't you want to eat it? Oh, he tried. He missed. Sometimes I actually, like, um, oh. no, eh, oh. no, eh, get down. Hold on. No. Go. I actually will. Sometimes put that down. That just helps them get them without getting any of that dirt. Get it. Get that, buddy. Oh, see that? There he goes. <laughs> so let's get more for him. Oh, some dogs are honking. Oh, and now he's scared because he heard the honking. Yay! Look at that. Look at that, bud. You see it?
Look at that. Oh. Whoa. Mm -hmm. That was the weirdest laugh I've ever did in my life. Please ignore it. I actually think these are super, might be super worms. Oh, he has turned, so we're gonna put his plate. He wants to show you guys his eating skills, apparently. He's very mean, he probably wants to eat you. He's not mean, he just got attitude. Isn't that right? Now he's turned again. Hey, buddy. Look. Oh. It's behind you. Can you turn around? Wow, he's a poser, guys. Look at how cute. Oh. Ooh. It fell. He turned. Yeah. Okay, that's alive. Here. Oh, get him. That's a super one. Oh, yes. Good. Oh, no, there's a hair. There's a cat hair. Um, if I try to get him, he's gonna bite me. There's a slight cat hair. My cats, unfortunately, do sometimes get near his cage. Here. Look right here. Look right there. Look up. Oh, I did this one. Cool. See it. Oh. Look. Right there. Yeah, get it. Good job. <laughs> get over there. Look! Do you see it? I don't know if you guys can see. There's a lot of dead ones in here. <clears throat> I have to go through and clean it soon. It's almost cleaning time for this bucket. I don't clean it too often, just because I don't really see a point. But to keep everyone healthy, I do clean it sometimes. I usually just pick out all the worms I can see. And so I'm like, here all the beetles I can see, take all the skins. And then, yeah, I usually do, that's how I usually clean it, just because there are, like, baby mealworms and stuff in here. So my gecko's very jealous. I don't know if you guys can see him. Can you see him? Mm. He's very jealous. That mister's getting his mouth. That's too cute. Look at that face. Mm -hmm. I'll see if I can get a really close up to the worm. Once I find a worm to give him, hold on. I'll find him. There's one. Oh. Oh. Trying to Oh, here's a big juicy one. I think this will be enough for him to see. There's a double wing. Hold on, it's stuck, don't go up there. Get, get off. There you go. Good job. Okay. Now I'll do the same exact thing. I'll put the hide back in. Remove that. I don't know. Hold on. I don't know if you guys can still see everything through there, but. Oh, and then we gotta put. He does have some dry soil. 
like that one in the right one, but some dry soil. Don't worry, it's not dripping on him or anything. So I was just spraying that. That is good. Sorry, buddy. I'm doing that. I'm going to take a stick. That's for his feet. Down. So you guys aren't going to really get to see him anymore. So I'm spraying. Get some closure. I really can't see him anymore. It's pretty much gone. He's still there, but like, he can't see him. And then. The final top. Spray the lid. Margo, still chilling by the way. Then Mister, we'll go back to his spot, which is right. Can't really see. Right there, where that cat is sitting. So yeah. Oh, there he is. He's back to say hello. Oh, what's he trying to eat? Well, I don't know. You guys can't see me, but we'll end on Mr. Mr. here. That is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, remember to like, subscribe, and share. If you enjoyed, if you didn't, don't worry about it. Uh, yeah, that is basically it. Oh, there's Mr. Cutie. And yeah, Fargo says to have a good day. I'm actually kind of thinking about just naming him Mr. Mr. Okay. Oh, oh no! Oh, there's a worm down there. Look at You see him? He's right there. Don't eat dirt. I need to find my tongs to get out. <laughs> okay. I'll let him eat this off camera. Because I gotta put him back. I have this worm. This is the last one that's. This is this room's last moment. Ooh. Mr. says to have a good day. And he will see you guys in the next video. Bye!